This program put on an offensive clinic last year, rolling through the regular season with a perfect 10 and 0 record. For next stop in our 21 teams in 21 days tour, News 13's Kaylee Tinglestad gives us a look at the Sneeds Pirates. If you attended a Sneeds football game in the 2022 season, you would have noticed the explosive offense that put up big numbers, including multiple games scoring over 70 points. But if you ask the players, they'll tell you it doesn't compare to what's ahead. You know, we're just doing everything right. You know, the O-line's blocking, getting strong, you know, like I said, so they're washing people down. We got, of course, a, a great running back. One of the players leading the way for the Pirates, Florida's leading rusher, Jason Patterson, who knows what comes with the territory. You say you're the best player on your team, best player in, in the state, you gotta, you gotta know that comes with it and um, just really focus uh, and trust in your teammates, trust in your coaches and continue to do what you do. While last season's numbers rushing for almost 3,000 yards and making 37 trips to the end zone seems like the Cincinnati commits peak, this year he's ready to prove there is no limit. I believe he's bigger, faster, and stronger this year. I believe he looks better this year. Just, you know, you think some kids, well, that's, that's, that may be his top end, but top end's still pretty good. I think he's gotten better. Patterson isn't the only veteran returning for the Pirates with eight offensive starters and nine defensive starters back in Navy and Gold ready to carry this team even further. Business world, you say it, rich people just get richer, you know, and, and for a poor guy, it's hard to ever get on top. And that's kind of the same thing with the football world. You know, once you get to that level and then the competition, it just makes it easier. And that's kind of where we're at. Coach Thomas says last year's offense was capable of winning a state title, but the defense was young and had vulnerable position groups. Now that defense is older and more experienced, ready to prove they can hang with the very best. If we're as good as I think we are defensively this year, I think we could really be at the next level. Last season came to a bitter end as rival Blenstown secured a Final Four ticket over Sneeds in the region final. Revenge is on their mind with a midseason matchup against the Tigers. I mean, we got pushed up in our locker room, you know, so like we, we, we all saw the score. We all know what's at state, you know, and it's, it's nothing that we don't like them. It just, you know, we so close to each other. We, we both good team that we, we won't beat each other real bad. With 15 seniors leading the way for the Pirates, they say anything less than a state title at the end of the season is a loss. This is the best chance we got so far, I feel like. I feel like this is the year. In Sneeds, Kaylee Tinglestad, News 13 Sports, Panhandle Strong. The Pirates will open their race.